Okay, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. We will start from page number 35, Adas Usadis, sixth lesson. So, start reading this grammar. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Lesson six. In this lesson, we learn the following: Zahabti. You went. Feminine singular, Zahabti. The number 11 to 20 with the feminine Madud. We have already already learned these numbers with the masculine Madud in lesson 3. Rules pertaining to these numbers with the feminine Madud have also been mentioned here. To summarize, 11 and 12, both parts of the numbers agree with the madud for example ahada ashara taliban for masculine and for feminine ihda ashara talibat talibatan isna ashara taliban isna ta ashara talibatan note that the letter Sheen has Fatah in Ashara and Sukun in Ashrata. <coughs> From 13 to 19. <laughs> Thirteen to nineteen. In these numbers, the second part agrees with the Madud. And the first part does not does not. <coughs> For example, Salasata Ashara Taliban. Samania Salasa Ashara Taliban. Samania to Asha Ashara Taliban. Yes. <laughs> I don't know how to do it. 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 I don't for masculine and for feminine, Salasa Asharata Talibatan. Here the second part is Asara is agrees Taliban and for uh, for masculine and for feminine Asharata is agrees with Talibatan. Like this Samaniata Ashara Taliban. Samani Asharata Talibatan. In Asharata Samani the word Samani has sukur. Ayu, Ayu means which. We have learned this word in book one. It is always mudaf and the noun following it is masroor because it is mudaf ilay. For example, Ayu Talibin Harbaja, which student went out. 
Aya kitabin qarata. Which book did you read? Bi ayi qalamin katabta. Which pen did you write with? So note note that in the first sentence ayu has dhamma. Second sentence ayu has fata. And third sentence ayu has kasra. So here you should understand the reason for this. Now start reading. Reason is written here. Okay. Note that the word ayu is marfu in the what first sentence marfu? because marfu is which word is end with dhamma. Okay. In the first sentence because it is Muftada and it is Muftada is end with Fata. No, no, Muftada means subject, and subject oh, always yes. have Dhamma. Subject. So, subject yes, is yes. always Marfu, that's why IU is Marfu. Muftada is uh, a subject, also, it is a uh, file or ism, sir. In English grammar, subject a uh, sentence has three parts: subject, verb, object. Okay. So same thing in Arabic. In Arabic, we also have a uh, subject which is called muktada, verb which is called fail, and object which is called maful bihi. Okay. So in Arabic, subject has always dhamma. Subject is always marfu. Okay, it can be file or it can be something else, but main thing it is always have it is always marfu. Okay, um, and it is mansub in the second because it is a full bihi and masroor in the third because it is preceded by the preposition. B. Preposition B. So now you understand the reason or not? Confusion in IU and IYA still. Subject to Vesa, you know what is the sentence? What is the definition of definition in English? Mean? Ji, isko noun noun. Sorry, noun. Okay. जो और इसको का काम करता है हां फाइल होता है जो काम करता है उसको हम सब्जेक्ट कहते हैं ठीक है इसमें अब आईयू से मतलब वो बंदा है जिसने कोई काम किया है हमें नहीं पता वो बंदा कौन है इसलिए हमने आईयू लगा दिया आईयू क्या सब्जेक्ट है काम करने वाला बंदा है काम करने वाला बंदा हमेशा मरफु होता है उसके ऊपर दम्मा होती है ठीक है अब दूसरे सब्जेक्ट में ये दूसरे सेंटेंस में सब्जेक्ट नहीं है बल्कि ऑब्जेक्ट है इसके ऊपर काम हुआ है अय्या किताबिन कौन सी किताब पढ़ी गई है अब पढ़ने वाला जो काम है वो किताब पर हुआ है और हमें नहीं पता वो कौन सी किताब है इसलिए हमने उस किताब की जगह अय्या लगा दिया जो भी कोई किताब है उस पे काम हुआ है इसलिए वो फिर मफूल भी है वो ऑब्जेक्ट है तो ऑब्जेक्ट पे आपने पता है आपको कि उसके ऊपर फता होती है यस सर आगे Azunno, I think. Azunno, Annaha Zahabat Ika Makkata. Azunno, uh, Azunno Annaha Zahabat Ika Makkata. I think that she went to Makkah. Anna is a sister of Inna, and so its ism is Mansub, and its hover is Marfu. So this thing will be explained in the example. Look at the example. For example, Azunu Anna Hamidan Maridun. I I think that Hamid is sick. So 
So here Hamid is ism of Anna and Mariz is khabar of Anna. So Hamid is mansub and Mariz is marfu. Okay? As you learned in the grammar that look at let me show you again. So its ism is mansub. That ism of Anna is always mansub and its khabar is always marfu. Okay? Azur no anna uh, anna imama jadidun. I think that the imam is new. Azur no anna Fatima ta I think that Fatima is absent. Azur no anna ka mutabun. I think that you are tired. Inata ahsanu talibin silfasli. Oh no, sorry. Kala inaka ahsanu talibin silfasli. He said, You are the best student in the class. <coughs> now that after Kala, the particle inna is used and not anna. Uh, lima. Lima means why? If it stands alone, a. Uh, ha. Ha. Okay. Uh, alone, a uh, ha is added to it. Lima. Ha, lima. This is called house sakti. Ha sakit. So lima mean why? <clears throat> For example, you say to me, I will not take class today. Then I will say Lima. Whatever I will say, Lima. Okay? Yes, sir. But uh, if you ask, uh, say the same thing, I will not take class to, uh, tomorrow, I will say Lima. Why you are, uh, I will say Lima. Why you will not take class? In that case, I will say this Lima. Lam kasa mim pata. When I uh, ask a sen complete sentence, then I will say this lima. And when I will just ask why, then I will say lima. Okay? Yes, sir. Got it. So this is the change in sentence. We have learned in book one some examples of adjectives ending in an. For example, on. Yeah. on. For example, Jawanu, Atshanu, Wazbanu. The feminine of such adjectives is on the pattern of Fa'ala. And the plural of both the masculine and the feminine is on the pattern of for example, Bilalun Jawanu Aminatu Jawa Arizalu Jiaun An Nisau Jiaun. Note there the plural of Kaslanu and Kasla is Kasla, Kusala. Kusala. Kusala is not uh, Fialun, not match with Fialun or Fahala. Okay, let's start from the beginning. Joanu is for masculine man who is angry. Joan is for man who is angry. And Joa and Joa is for the woman, she is angry. Okay? And Jiaun is the plural of this. And this pattern is Fialun. 
this pattern is phi r so here they are telling you two things first that the feminine of such word which are on the pattern of juanu achanu is fala and the plural of such word is phi alun but then they are telling us a special case of kaslan in the case of kaslan the plural is not on the pattern of fialun but it is a special word it is called kusala you have to memorize this word okay, okay? for all other words uh, just memorize the pattern of fala and fialun hati give bring um okay give for bring not it's is nad to the other pronouns of the second person ya ahmadu hati uh ya zainabu hati ya ikhwanu hatu ya akhawatu hatina what is the meaning of isnad sir isnad means uh, is derived from sanad the act of uh, adding pronoun to a word is called sanad asnad so hati is a basic word is the base word and it can be used for men only in case of female we will sanad sanad it with ya we will join it with ya it become hati so hati is the word for feminine in case of plural means we will sanad the word hati with waw alif with the, we will sanad the word with waw alif it will become hatu so this is called sanad then in the case of feminine plural we will sanad it with ya noon it will become hatina this process of adding pronoun is called sanad okay yes sir who's, who's tech you will learn the imperative form of the verb in lesson 14 fafariha bil mudar mudarrisu katsiran so the teacher was greatly pleased uh, sorry so the teacher was greatly pleased with me here fa means so and b means with me okay not fariha farihtu bika i was i was pleased with you farihu bina they were pleased with us so b mean with me bika mean with you bina mean with us okay and b he mean with him with him a afari afari ta bihi where did you pleased with him no that zahab zahab ta can be read in four ways with four meanings zahabat she went she went uh, zahab zahabta you for masculine you went zahabti you feminine went zahabtu 
I went. Ajaan time, sir. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikumsalam. Ayat mana yang mereka tahu? Okay, perhati. 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 Fahim tu jayyidan, I have understood it well. Aymar watun, building. Zadakallahu ilman. May Allah increase. Suratun, surah. Yes, may Allah increase. Suratun, surah. Shakatun, flat. Sinnun tuth, mashallah, literally, what Allah wills, an expression of surprise. We use mashallah to protect the next person or thing from evil eye. Kalimatun, word, rakibun, passenger in a bus, train, plane, etc. Ya Bunay, Ya Bunay, Ya, Oh my little son. Okay. Ya Ibni, Ya Bunay, Ya. What is different between both words? Ya Ibni, Oh my, Oh my son, and here, 
Oh my little Literally little both words are same. But Ya Ibni is used for simplicity. For calling him simply. But Ya Buneya uh, is used for calling him with love. Okay? When we simply okay. call our uh, children, we call Ya Ibni. And when we call with love, we say Ya Buneya. Also here, I used little, little son. They usually this is used for little son, but the main thing is this, that it is used for calling him with love. Okay, Fariha, he was pleased. Masroorun, pleased, happy. Khairimatun, mad, servant, fakat, only, ja, he came. Did you put it there, Hiti? Yes, sir. Who was it, Hiti? Two, right? Yes. Yes. कौन सी वीडियो देखी पहली वीडियो देखी है दूसरी वीडियो देखी है दोनों देख ली अच्छा चलो ठीक है अच्छा ठीक और चलो ठीक अब ये पढ़ना शुरू कर देंगे अब दरुसु सादिसु सिक्स लेसन अल उम्मो मता रजा आता मिनल मदरा सती या बुनिया when did you come from school? Oh, my little son. Return. Return. Sorry. When you, when did you return from school? Oh, my little son. Rajaatu Kabla Nisfi Saatin. I, I returned um, half an hour before. Ago. I returned half an hour ago. Alumu, Aina of Tuka, Mariamu. Where is your, um, where is your sister, Mariam? Ama Rajaat. Return. Did not she return? Did, did not she return? <clears throat> Said La Adri. No. What is the meaning of Adri, sir? La Adri, I don't have any idea. La I don't Adri. know. Mujhe koi I don't know. I don't have any idea. Ana ma ro ai tu ha. I don't. Uh, I did not see her. Alumu ma za karatal yom yom ma. Did you read today? What did you read to you? Said. Varat Varatri Yoma Jadida Jadidan Varatul Yoma Darsan Jadidan Til Sikka Til Sikka Sikki Til Sikki I read I read. New I read new lesson. Today I, re I read new lesson in Sikha. What is that? Sikha, Sikha is Islamic law. Islamic, Islamic club? Islamic jurisprudence. What? Yes. Islami Shariat. Sikha means Shariat. 
I understood it very well. Alumu Ama Kora Ama Kora Kora Tul Kuran Al Yomi Karatal The Kim of Bartko Mukat Kari, it was Kili Karatal Taki for Fataya, which have appeared in Bath Kate with Taki with Damati Ama Karatal Kuran Al Yomi. Ama Karatal Kurana Kuran Mafol B. Ama Kurat Karatal Kuranal Yomi Yoma Ama Karatal Kuranal Yoma. Did you read Kuran today? Did not you read? Quran today. Kya tum ne aaj Quran nahi pada? Oh, my sister no. Saeed. Bala. Yes. Karatu. 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 Ab apne li baat kar raha hu. Karatu. Bala. Karatu. Surat al Rahmani Surat Yes, I read Yes, I read Surat al Rahman. I memorized. Yes, I read Surah Tul Rahman and memorized it. Safariha Bil Mudar Bil Mudar Risu. Safariha Bil Bil Mudar Risu Kasiran. Safariha. So The teacher was greatly pleased with me. So the teacher was pleased. So greatly so the was pleased very. with me. So the teacher was very pleased with me. Mokala and he said, Innaka Ahasanu Taliban Filfasli. Asanu Talibin Ya bin degrees Padithi Superlative degree Kibad Agla word Majrurota Asanu Talibin Innaka Asanu Talibin Silfasli Indeed you uh, Indeed you best student you are the in best student class. in the class Indeed, you are the best students in the class. Alumu, Masha Allah, what Allah will? Zadak Allah, Ilman, Ya Bunaya, Zadaka. Increase. May Allah increase your knowledge. May Allah increase your knowledge. Oh, my little son, Sa'id, Agasalti Umsani Ya Ummi. Did you wash? Did you wash uh, shirts? My shirts. Umsani 
माई शर्ट माई शर्ट ओके Did you wash my shirt or my mother? Alumu naam yes. Wasal tu ha wa kawai tu ha yes. I washed it and I ironed it. Wasal tu ha. Ha me them. Ha me them. I washed them. Kuchani pula lazhe zada se chate. मैंने उन सब शर्ट को धो दिया और वो इस्त्री कर दिया ओके दिस इज ब्यूटिफुल more beautiful than this that is more beautiful than this okay ye video nahi dekhi chale fir ruk jate hain muskani कल यहीं से हम शुरू कर देंगे ठीक है पेज नंबर थर्टी सिक्स है